King Mitch! King Mitch? Hello? Uh, Are you good, sir? Uh, yeah. Uh, sorry, I dozed off. Uh, that is fine. You are mighty good. Are you good, Amir? I'm good! Uh, I was just doing a spot of reading. Hmm. Uh, Are you good? Uh, you appear to have fallen asleep in your chair. I've been better, that's for sure. Mm hmm. Uh, Are you troubled? Uh, t troubled's a small word in, in comparison to all the conflicts going on. Uh, that is true. More stress than anything. Well, let me relieve that stress. I don't know. I, I, Is there something I can do for you? Well, I am getting all these letters made up. Maybe you could deliver them. That'd be nice. Oh, what? Uh, might I uh, impose and ask what those uh, letters are for? Well, as you know, this current conflict going on, not only just here, but between Indeed. demis and gods. The main reason why I'm being troubled at the moment is because I believe I was just given a prophecy via a dream. Oh, you had a prophecy too? Hmm. Maybe. I'm not too sure what it was exactly, but it seems like the gods are trying to communicate to me in some way or form. And I don't that think makes sense. it's a good thing. Oh, I see. They told me to basically be safe. And don't mess up. So, I don't know what oh. exactly that well, means. Well, those are some very positive, uh, positive words. Uh, I, thought my I guess. I thought my father was the most negative out of everyone, but it seems like other gods take that prize. That is true. They do have their uh, tendencies. Hmm. I don't know. It's very... But I will humbly accept... The quest to uh, deliver said letters. Yeah. Are there any in particular folk that you feel like I should uh, deliver them to? Hmm. Well, there's definitely a few. I think Xylo, the son of Hades, is definitely one. I haven't seen him okay. in a long time. Write but... these down. Xylo, the son of Hades. Uh, I believe, if I remember the name of the dog correctly, I believe it was Inpu, son of Anubis. That might be a good ah, one. Ah, yes. I've heard of his name before. Hmm. What are some others that I could think of mm -hmm. off the back of my hand? There's not many I know. There was a lot of new people that came to Camp Oasis last time I visited, so I didn't meet a lot of them. But I'm sure some of them are still around, considering the years have gone by. Wait, you want me to go to Camp Oasis? Um, well, actually, I plan on going myself. Oh, so I should meet you there. I believe that would probably be the best course of action. After delivering the letters, of course. I've actually set up the letters to have some type of ability. I hope it works, but you should get a sense of a demi when you walk around. So that way, in case we don't know any more, oh. you'll be able to deliver this letter to anyone we don't know. That's a good idea. I shall do a lot of talking and take my notes. Mm -hmm. hmm. Sounds like a great idea. Yes. Perfect. Do you have a copy of the letter? Do I need to make copies? Uh, yes, I do, actually. I, I did end up finishing. Ah, good. So there you are. There we go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, right, I'll put that in my book, and I will get copies of that made and uh, sent off to said individuals. Mm. 
A uh, question for you, since yes. you're probably running around. Anything for you, Saya? How are the people today? Are they still rowdy? Uh, yeah, they appear to be a little bit rowdy, yes. <sighs> They're not exactly thrilled. Great. I'm hoping that will change I'm over doing time. I'm everything in my power, which is not very much, to deal with them. Of course, I appreciate it, and I'm sure the general and maybe some of the mermaids and stuff like that can help me out too, but... <sighs> Indeed. I would like a little bit of assistance from them. Mm. Some of them do get a little bit rough and pull on my hair. I apologize, it's not your problem. It's more or less mine. Nope, it's fine. You are the king. Some days I wish I wasn't. <sighs> I just hope over time the people learn that I'm not like my father. You, yes. They will learn. We will make them. In some way, shape, or form. I prefer for this to go peacefully, unlike my father, who would rather just kill the problems away. It's not what I plan on doing. No, that could be detrimental to your stature. Hmm. They already don't known. like you because you're a demigod, so I don't think we should give in to the whole gods being gods and killing people all the time. Yeah, I'd rather not uh, take after my Though father's legacy. Though I'm not legacy. here to stand here and uh, tell you what to do, of course. You do what you do or do. Hmm. No, I appreciate your wisdom. It'll definitely help. Good. I, I, I appreciate the kind words. They mean no. They mean a lot more than you think. Hmm. All right. Well, I think from here I should probably head out to Camp Oasis and see if any demigods are showing up there. I'm sure some are just coming for the camp in general, but maybe recruiting some more people who are showing up might be a good idea. I could see that being a very valid strategy. And it'd be nice to see some old friends. I do also need to talk to Brian, possibly. Uh, it's been a oh. while, but I think maybe fixing our problems between each other might be a good idea. I haven't spoken to him in a long time. Ever since the whole... Problem fixing does sound like a good thing. Yeah. Would definitely improve, you know, your kingly duty and make more people, I don't know, like, look more towards you. Maybe. But yeah, let me head out, and please try yes. and get those letters done as soon as possible. I will. I will head to the printers right now, get them printed, and I will set off on my uh, my journey. Perfect. All right, I'm going to go take one of the seahorses and see if I can get to Camp Oasis in due time. No worries. Right. I will uh, meet you there. Okay. The general's in charge until I come back. Uh, Yes. Sounds good. <sighs> oh, hey, everybody. Yeah, it's been a bit. I haven't really used you guys. Oh, I should probably put the crown away, too. It might not be a good idea to have it out. They might take a few bites. <laughs> All right. Everybody watch out. Here I come. Woo! Hello. I'm reaching out to you because I heard you're a little like me. You grew up different. There's a part of you that you may not understand. We're here to help. There's a place. A place full of people like you and I. A place where people aren't judged for what makes them special. The Oasis of Demeter. Or as we like to call it, Camp Oasis. A place where demigods of all pantheons can come together to learn more about themselves and feel accepted and protected. While you're here, we can keep you safe from the many dangers that come with this whole demigod package. Together. We hope to see you soon. Counselor Zylo of Camp Oasis.
Ah, uh, Camp Oasis. Man, I hate this place. <sighs> I hope that for once nothing is going on. Looks like I spoke too soon. Um, hello? Miss? Well, she's breathing, that's a good sign. And of course, no counselors are around to look after the campers here. Well, I can't just leave her here, so looks like I'm gonna have to carry her. I hope I remember where the infirmary is. I hope my fiance doesn't see me carrying another woman like this. Is that fish I smell? I heard that. No. No way. Fish boy! Hello. Good to see you again. Likewise. A bit, I guess. Uh, um, who's this? I don't know. Apparently it's one of your campers that was out on the beach. Knocked out when I arrived. Must be another new arrival, I suppose. Or an arrival for me, uh, give or take. Why is everything so loud? Maybe uh, we should talk quieter. Uh, Maybe she's waking up. Uh, <sighs> hey, you, uh, you alright? Uh, um. Where am I? Welcome to Camp Oasis. A summer camp? I ended up all the way at a summer camp? Yeah, it's a type of summer camp, I suppose. <laughs> um, who are you guys? Where's my dad? I'm assuming not a camper. No, not yet, at least. <sighs> Anything else crazy that's gonna happen the moment I get here? Did Welcome, I end up at some type of hmm. renaissance festival or something? What? Oh, no. Um, where... Do I look like some for renaissance? I mean, we, we kind of got the... Can someone button. tell me where I am and what's going on? Hello. Uh, well, another camper? <laughs> yeah, yeah, come in. Just, you know, try to remain calm. Yeah, he's okay. new here. <laughs> what are you? Is that a tail? Okay, yes, yes, it is a tail. Oh, yes. Yeah, so, so you're you, uh, scared of the monkey, but not... All right. Um, you really don't um, know what's going on, do you? something I said. Should hmm. I know what's going on? Well, I think you're here because you're like us. I'm like you. You're special. I'm special? <sighs> what he's I trying to say is that I you're remember. a demi. Demigod of other gods in mythology. That's what he's trying to explain. Sure sounds like it. <laughs> is this some type of sick joke? What is the last thing I can remember? I can remember... I can't remember where I was. I was running from something. Kept hearing some voice in my head. I thought I was going crazy. And then... Classic. I tripped on something in the sand, and then I blacked out, and... Was it some sort of monster you were running from? I'm not sure what it was. I just remember it had the worst smell in the entire world, and I didn't even want to look back, because I was so scared. Maybe something no. from the gods. I thought you only just got here. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> Now that's, now that's, now I see what you just did there. <laughs> uh, but, um... Can we just, can we cut the cameras? Can we get rid of the jokes? Can you guys tell me what's going on? Um, okay. You just want it straight? Um, the name, yeah. Hi, the name's Ning. Ning Wukong. Nice to meet you. Wukong? Isn't that some video game character? Uh, oh, yeah. Donkey. This is gonna be rough. Probably Donkey Kong. Okay, so he's the child of an ancient monkey king. I'm the son of Hades, um, from Greek. And he he's the son of Poseidon. He's also a king of Atlantis. How are you? And Yeah. You guys have some sick role-playing going on, but I, I just want to go mean, home. I mean, if you... <laughs> role-playing. Uh -huh, that's funny. Why would you be... Why would that... That's crazy to think that. Uh -huh. Look, trust me, I'm not into role-playing, I'm just into helping people. And this is 
good can place you help to me do it. get out of here and go home back to where I belong? Do you want to go home or do you want to figure out why you're here? Look, you look like so we you can find a, a way to get you home, but you said you heard a voice that led you here? Yeah, I think so. Well, obviously, if she's here, she's a demi. Yeah. Got here by yourself, and it's most likely the case. Yeah, it would have stopped me but at the exactly gate. what exactly is this place? Camp Oasis! Camp Oasis. <laughs> yeah, this place is great. Yeah, it's a camp full of people yeah. like us, with parents of different pantheons, powerful deities. Well, look, the only reason why I came back was because I needed to talk to you. But oh. that's clearly not happening yet. I mean, we'll, we'll talk soon, I'm sure. we got a lot to catch up on. Um, how, about, how, about, how about I show you around? Maybe but, that'll... That sounds tour, fine, tour. but I think that you have the wrong idea. I My parents can't be gods from different pantheons. I know my dad, and well, my Here dad would have told me if my mom was... All right, let's my, go outside. We'll give you the spiel. Okay. You How do I know I can time. trust you guys? Well, we haven't tried to kill you yet, so I think that's yeah. probably the best option. Right this way. Wow. Ah, the fresh outdoors. Yep. Those are some Come interesting decorations that you have in there. Oh, yeah. Um, Other monsters and stuff. Monsters? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. So notice you made the infirmary your office. Well, this used to be uh, Kay's office, and then Aww. I've Zylo's taken over. Office. Ah, mm. it's been so long. I don't think Zylo. I want... That that would be me. Oh, oh. Zylo, son of Hades. Guess everyone might as well introduce me. You haven't introduced yourself formally. <sighs> My I lord. Guess not. Please don't. <laughs> My lord, are you royalty or something? <laughs> Sorry, as I may believe, yes. <laughs> I am the current ruler of Atlantis. I am Mitchell, son of the Poseidon. It's very nice to meet you. Sorry if I seem a little tense. It's been a little stressful. And I wasn't expecting to find somebody knocked out on the beach when I first arrived. Are you the one who found me? Yes. Makes sense. Well, thank you for bringing me here, I guess. Of course. Yeah. And I think you said your name Wukong, right? Yep, Ning Wukong, at your service. Uh... Well, I'm Brinley. From nice to meet you, Brinley. Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, LA. Nice to meet you, Brinley. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, milady. <laughs> and anyway, in the words of an old friend of mine, um, you're a wizard. <laughs> what? Ignore him. <laughs> you're uh, most likely a demigod of some kind. Yeah. You said you uh, know your father? Yeah. He works cool. in real estate. Oh, you know, we're always off on business trips. He's going to be so worried about me. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be in so much trouble when I get home. And what about be... your mother? Does she live with you? Um, I've never met her. That narrows it down. That narrows it down quite a bit. So um, maybe from the human world is your original what? place. That would make sense. Indeed. Mm. A running theory is that whoever your mother is, apparently some sort of goddess. Maybe. Ooh. Which one? Which one? Is the huh. question. Which one is one? Well, you know, I've always had people compare me to a goddess, but I never thought my mom would be one. Yeah. Uh, anyways. Mean, I, let me think. The last time I figured out my stuff was uh, about uh, a little over 200 years ago, give or take. 200 right. years? Yeah. Well, anyways, uh, um, you said you were going to show me around? Yeah. Anyway, this is um, where I'm at. If you ever need help, come here. You'll find me. Or if you're ever injured, go there, and um, someone will hopefully be able to help you. Uh, over that way, have we have an staff? arena. What? What do you mean, hopefully? Uh, don't you have staff? Yeah, we don't have a lot of medical professionals here at this point. Ah, jeez. No, we, we got one, heard, but, and then we got... I mean... We got staff. I mean, didn't you get... I heard you, like, got stabbed 28 times. You seem fine. That's, that, that was different. And we had a better doctor here at the time. Mm, that's a story you'll have to tell yeah. me. Oh, you haven't heard that one. Huh. Yeah. Well, 
Anyway, over that way is an arena where people fight each other to the death sometimes. Okay. Not to the death. This is a camp, not a. Uh, <laughs> this is what people say. Here's a graveyard of. I've noticed people. a lot more new additions, Zylo. Oh yeah, I remember. I remember when you. I remember when you showed showed me the graveyard, but it wasn't actually you. You, I guess I. I suppose it was that that other guy. That was impersonating you. What? <laughs> he was at the graveyard too. Ah uh, ah. Uh. Yeah, I had some guy impersonating me uh, the other day. Well, his brother led me on a wild goose chase. I see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was it was fun. It looked like fun. Over there is where we have some of the cabins. They have a uh, Japanese and Asian theme to them. I imagine one of those <clears> will be where <throat> you're living. Chinese as well, please. Yep, very much so. <laughs> so. I remember that a little bit from my last visit. Yeah. Visit? Are so. you not from here? <laughs> Heck oh, no. he's from here. It's just he moved. Uh, I'd rather not be here any longer than I need to be. Oh, what? Sorry, why, I guess that's my so... fault. No. Why are you such a grumpy pants? This camp seems like fun. <laughs> hey, what you got against the camp now, huh? Uh, look, that's something we'll discuss later. All right. Sure. I mean, I mean, yeah, there was a guy impersonating the camp council, so he said, oh, yeah, I had to step him to teach him a lesson, but it's fine. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, Look, we had a good... A good run, and that was the first stabbing in months. All right. <laughs> well, See why I don't like this I don't place. encounter anything like that. Yeah. <laughs> Everything should cool yep. down now. Up there is a lounge area. We have some events held there. I'm um, over that way. Yeah. Just fun games, stuff like that. Over there is where we have uh, some of the other cabins. Most of those have a, a Greek theme to them. Greek. That's where I used to uh, stay. <laughs> then you know we got your regular camp stuff picnic area more cabins we have an egyptian themed area over there we have our own pyramid small one but mm. remember that home. from last time too i it's believe what, i met in Intpu. i believe yeah Intpu's a good Ooh. friend of mine mm. in mm -hmm. so, he sounds fun yeah he's a little like me except such strange names <laughs> xylo wukong uh what was oh. yours again it's Mitchell. Mitchell. What's wrong with Mitchell? Oh. Well, that one's pretty normal, I guess. But and thank you it's for probably the normalest out of everybody here. Oh, please, call me Ning. <laughs> and here is our mess hall. Here's mainly where people go to eat. Ooh. Sometimes we hold large gatherings and events and stuff like that here. There better not be I any fish a, on I the menu. I heard there's a food-eating monster here as well. I, large big gatherings one. and events? I don't make the menus. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, well, what about that big like menu-eating like, monster? Like parties? <laughs> well, we. It's been a few years since we held any parties, per se. Why is um, that? We. Any stabbings going on? Um, funny enough, yeah, something like that. So. Ooh. So we try to limit the the parties around here. Kind of first bad experience I had was in this very room. It was the uh, ball of Aphrodite, where. Yeah. A ball. Yeah, like a dance bunch of people came had a good time for part of it then that certain people split lovely. themselves in half became evil and set me on fire oh that doesn't sound lovely well that night for me actually <laughs> led me down a very nice path I probably mean, the only nice thing i got from here uh, why has it been so lit. long since you had a ball why don't you have them anymore hey, because bad things happen huh. as long as i'm around here we're not having another one yeah Ooh. definitely don't need any more aphrodites that's for sure yeah, true what does that mean well, I mean, unfortunately, due to many circumstances, there's no longer any children of Aphrodite here. So, you know, I guess just happens yeah. to be no one to run a ball like that. Uh -oh. Such a shame. A ball seems like so much fun. Uh, you guys seeing what I'm seeing? Hmm? Um... What? Why are you all looking at me like that? Looks like my suspicions are right. You are a demi. No. No. Exactly. No. I've already told you that's not possible. <laughs> <laughs> She's glowing? <laughs> no. 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 No, 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 no. What the hell? What's going on? What's his problem? No. Not another one. 
No, 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 nope, 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 nope. Not another what? Assuming what just happened and given Xyla's reaction, it looks like you're a daughter of Aphrodite's. What does that mean? It means welcome to the realm of the demigods, Brindley. Oh! <sighs> All right. Where did the knucklehead run off to? Oh, huh? there you are. What you call me? Don't worry about it. Seriously, uh, what kind of reaction was that? What do you mean, what kind of reaction is that? Now, look, I get it. We have a history with the Aphrodite children, but... Uh-huh. She's new. And maybe not yeah, a psychopath. It's... She seems really nice. But they all did at the start. Yeah. Oh. I know. <sighs> anyway, now that that's through... What are you doing here? Yeah, about that. Uh, before we get on to uh, that matter, it is nice to see you again. It's definitely been a while. Yeah. Thought you'd stop by and visit more, but... I guess I could do the same, but, you know, water and stuff. Yeah. Well, luckily I found that a new way around that, but that'll be explained later. The main right. reason why I'm here is because I sent out a letter to any demigod children in search yeah. that they would come here, which maybe some have and maybe some are just showing up randomly. But either or is fine by me. I mean, it's pretty much that time of year again. We've been reaching out to those in need ourselves. So, hmm. yeah, I figured this a place... lot of people showing up. Yeah, I figured this place would be the perfect spot to gather the children so what are you gathering other demigods for <sighs> there are some ongoing uh problems i guess is the word as always uh, yeah but Before... this time it's getting a little more intense how so uh without well i don't explain myself too many times but i'll give you a little bit of what's going on so there seems to be something going on between not only the demigods, but also the gods themselves. But it's not just one mythology. It seems to be a scatter of them. And I'm unsure of what it means. I recently was met by a god, but I don't know which one. And they told me to basically not screw up. Uh, like they got their eyes on you, huh? Yeah, literally. But yeah, besides that, there's also some issues going on in Atlantis, which personally it's my own issues, but I figured inviting guys there maybe might change that. But I'm more or less worried about the whole gods and demigods and possible destruction of our world more than Atlantis. Yes. Well, the pantheons have never exactly gotten along together, have they? <laughs> now, the festival of the pantheons was just a way for them to blow off steam for the most part. True. But even that, you know... Doesn't quite solve any problems, just kind of sweeps them away. Yeah. Been able to do a lot here, you know. A lot of demigod children of different pantheons have been friendly with each other, getting together, learning about each other. Hmm. Not fighting for the most part, but there's still a lot of problems out there. Yeah. And I'm also dealing with my own personal issues back in Atlantis. Uh, I mean, as you know, I recently became the king. Uh, yeah. Not too many people are happy about that. I'd say about 90% about of the population is not happy. Because he didn't grow up royalty? No, it's because of Poseidon. As you know, my father is not one of the nicest gentlemen. I suppose not. Uh, so now that there is a new king, and it's, it turns out to be the son of said god, uh, some people don't like that. Some are scared, some are envious. It's more scared than envious. Also, yeah, well. they don't approve of my fiance, so that's another issue on top of that. Oh, fiance, huh? Yeah, that was new. Uh, as you know, me and Marsh were together for a while after the camp, and we ended up continuing to date since. Uh, Master Wingman right here. Woo. <sighs> but yeah. Yeah, I'm very happy with her. And recently, I asked her to be my wife, 
And then after that, about a week later, I became king. So yeah, it was good, but bad timing. Things even more. Yeah, they're not very happy that she isn't a, a demi in a sense. They don't like her I mean, being a creature. I guess you have a point there. <sighs> it's been a nightmare. Yeah, it's been good around here up until recently, I suppose. Yeah. Also, speaking of around here, um, I hate to go from friend to your enemy here. Um, yeah. But I've noticed issues that are still happening nearly five years later. What kind of issues? We got most of them kind of ironed out. Well, I guess the first one being that when I showed up, there was a camper on the coast knocked out. Yep, they found a camp. Uh, let's see. There was also the graveyard. I noticed that there were a lot more graves in there than usual. Hey, some of those were from people that went missing back when you were here. You also and... said that there's an arena where people fight, possibly to the death? No, it's not to the death. It's just a joke everyone always says before they go in the arena. It's the same arena as always. No, you, you fought in it before, I fought in it before. It's just for games. Mm. And also, some of the graves are from an incident that happened five years ago, which has been contained. You also said stabbings are going on, apparently recently, and it's not even that long ago either. There's only two that are recent. Two? I mean, yeah, one was one of the new campers stabbed me, and, and then another one was about 20 minutes after and I stabbed that camper's brother. You stabbed a camper? But well, he was trying to, he was causing problems in the camp. Oh, he was scaring people. Lord. He was trying to pretend to be me so he could raid the camp. Mm. He's been dealt with and he's, he's fine now. A quick trip to the underworld did him some good. Now look, I'm gonna be completely honest here, uh, as friends. Not as... And most of the stabs happened like five years ago, to be honest. Look, all I'm saying is personally, if your cabin, or our cabin, I guess, mm -hmm. back in the day, if it had burned down to a crisp and the rest of these cabins caught fire and this camp no longer existed, I would have been very happy knowing what would have happened years later. Personally. What do you mean? You say that as a good thing? I'm saying this camp has a lot of issues. Yeah, and it solves a lot of issues, too. Yes, but it also creates more issues, is what I'm saying. Which is why we're leading back into Demis and the gods. Personally, It's not I that think the camp's creating the issues, it's the people who come here have issues. <sighs> issues that we don't want to leave them on their own to figure out. If people that have, you know, god-level issues are just dealing with them themselves outside of a place with supportive peers, what do you think is going to happen? Things have happened before. We want to be there for everyone. Look, personally, if I could shut this place down, I would. In a heartbeat. Well, good thing you can't. Uh, people need it. Maybe not yet. What do you mean? I don't know. I'll figure something out. We'll see. Well, it certainly has been a while, hasn't it? It's been a while. Like I said, I don't want to be sour in our reunion, but there are lots of issues going on. I don't need the camp creating more issues. Well, we'll deal with whatever issues come our way, as we always do. Yes. Now, I'm assuming more children will be showing up eventually. Indeed. Hopefully. Got a bunch already. Some with IQ, maybe, or some that don't have amnesia and other things maybe some reliable campers that'd be great that i don't mean create hey, issues. most people don't know a lot about themselves and those who do are often some of the most problematic so yes i'm hoping for less problems whether they know of what they can do or not doesn't matter to me i just hope that everything goes smoothly what is it you're planning with all these people anyway you'll find out in due time just know that once most or all of the campers have shown up, and maybe some old friends as well, we are going to need to make a trip to Atlantis. I plan on having a massive meeting between a lot of the Pantheons, and hopefully it'll go well. Nothing wrong with the meeting. Alright, looking forward to it. 
Hmm. Now, if you'll excuse me, I guess I'll take a look around this place. Maybe I'll run into somebody I might know. Maybe some people I don't. Uh, we'll see. All right, I'll catch you later. Yeah, and try to not stab the campers, please. Uh, I won't. And also... The fish boy. Yeah. Don't mess with my camp, all right? Yeah. Also, attempt to get a relationship that works, please. That's where the stab wounds come from! What do you mean? <sighs> Dating is hard. <laughs>